Many of us like going for Sunday brunch. Many of us also like lounging around in our PJs. But what if I told you there's now a place you can do both? Veronica Cooper explains. We're not at the point yet where we have to Three friends chatting at Northern Quarter Restaurant, but one is in slippers and a bathrobe to help feed hungry kids. We have around 3,000 kids in this city that live below the poverty level. And many go to school every day hungry. So what we want to do is ensure that as many children as possible have that opportunity to access nutritious food. That's the goal of the nonprofit Breakfast in Music they have to be able to focus. It helps their concentration. It helps their development overall. If a kid can't focus, how is he going to learn? So how does the bathrobe fit in? I'm going to brunch in my pajamas. Not everybody has to, though. <laughs> We're co-hosting this YYJ Pajama Party, which is a citywide pajama party where folks can go out for brunch at 14 participating restaurants and those restaurants are going to donate partial proceeds to the foundation. Rebecca Wellman, author of First We Brunch, jumped at the chance to help with this fundraiser. I've been a food photographer in Victoria for over 11 years so I've, uh, ha I've got relationships with a lot of these people. 14 Victoria restaurants will commit 25 percent of their brunch profits on Sunday, September 23rd to Breakfast to Music, which hopes to raise $10,000. It seems strange that we need to have events like this, but the fact that we are and the fact that we can be involved to help with it is, is really important, so we're glad to be involved. There's also live music and pancakes for families on the lawns of Government House from 12 till 2. It's important. It's, a, it's something that we can actually do something about, these kids that are going to school hungry. 100% of those funds will go for food. Food for these kids that need it desperately. Learn more or donate to Breakfast to Music through the links tab on our website. Vital People is brought to you in part by the Victoria Foundation. Connecting people who care with causes that matter.